Hey, a pleasant good day, everybody. This is Sportsman at News. I'm Joe Borg, and this is going to be a quick couple-minute recap of the Flyers smacking the New Jersey Devils around 6-1 to one after getting off to a killer start where I talked about in the game preview. It's all about the start, right, and it's all about the finish. Well, they had a best 60-minute game they probably played all season. The Devils were the Achilles heel, just like the Marlins were the Achilles heel to the Phillies thus far for the Philadelphia Flyers. And as always, please continue to subscribe down below. Love your support for it, the 175 that have this far. Please help us get to our goal of 180 by Christmas. But what a game by the Flyers. The Flyers are now 3-2 and two in the yo era, above 500, not doing this dumbass dump and chase system. They're actually carrying it into the zone, and it's drawing results. Um, this was the game best by far by Sanheim and Risto, I believe. There was a goal and an apple for Sanheim. That good drag move, the goal that Blackwood would want back. Um, he wasn't good in this game. That's why he was removed and replaced with a guy that is still trying to develop. Only has 10 AHL games in Akira Schmid, but um, Blackwood was not good in this game. Risto had two assists, and also nice to see Provy come out of his shell because he hasn't been good this year where he was able to get two apples himself. So a defense was pushing the offense well, entering the zone well. Sandheim, you can tell with Yo. It seems like he told him to be more aggressive. He's kind of entering the zone with a much different um, pace. Max Wilman's playing fantastic. Yo compliment uh, Wilman's game um, after the game, and he's playing very well. He was able to pick up an apple as well, so that was really good to see. And then Atkinson gets a hat-trick plus an assist on Lindblom's second goal, which was fantastic to see Oscar continue to play a sharper game and get rewarded for it as well. Uh, things seem to be coming together for this team. It's only a three-game sample size. Obviously, a ten-game sample size for the losing streak is much bigger than a three-game sample size. And Travis Sanheim and Rista, who I just complimented, they were not good on that one shift that they did allow the goal. So that shows the bad of that line. But the good of that line is if they can pitch it in, if Risto pitches in and is able to chip it in like he did on that one play for the goal, then that's very helpful because he's a big body defenseman. He's not a guy you're going to hit off the puck that easily or be able to beat if you're a smaller guy to the puck that easily because he'll just knock you off of it and then chip it in anyway. And then Sanheim is a more inclined offensive defenseman than he's shown, and it seems like Yo is kind of instilling that and preaching that to him. Maybe Williams is as well. Uh, because you're seeing him get into the zone a little bit better in these last couple of games. And then we saw Cam Atkinson just play like a bat out of hell in this game and get the hat trick. I mean, the one goal, that pass from G in front uh, for the hat trick goal was an absolute dime from Claude Giroux, who continues to have a killer season this year. Justin Braun scored in a flutter puck, so Limblum had a goal and an assist, so he had a great game tonight as well. Uh, that was a weird play that Blackwood wasn't able to pick him up. I'm not quite sure why he wasn't able to pick up that puck, but he wasn't able to pick up that puck. And then, again, um, Atkinson had an assist on the um, Limblum goal, so I would say the stars of this game were sure as heck Cam Atkinson obviously is the first star of this game. And then I would say the second star is that pairing between Risto and Sanheim, by far their best game of the entire season, where Risto's been better than Sanheim this year, but this is by far Sanheim's best game of the entire season. Um, obviously, I think the third star then will go to fan favorite Oscar Limblum assist. And a goal, where I think Wilman looked good as well, but I'll give it to Oscar in this game, because Wilman had the assist, didn't have a goal, Oscar had the assist, and a goal. So this has been a quick recap to the Flyers spanking the New Jersey Devils 6-1, to came in, had a great start to this game, and then they just never looked back. Uh, this was one of the first games of the season. He had a great start, and then just beat the team in pretty much every period of the game, and every facet of the game, the only great chance that the Devils had was not even necessarily the scoring chance. That was because Subban just had a good shot. It was a couple chances by Brad and a couple of nice saves on the power play by Hart, but they didn't have many high-octane chances in this game. Flyers played a great game, finally found a way to get over the Achilles heel and get that monkey off their back and beat the New Jersey Devils. So this has been a quick recap of the Flyers having, yes, three is the magic number, a three game winning streak. Hopefully it can continue and the Flyers can keep the winning ways going against another downtrodden team in the Montreal Canadiens on Thursday up there in Quebec, in Montreal, Quebec. Peace out, everybody. Stay safe. And I hope you enjoy the content. If you do, please continue to subscribe down below on the Easy Use sub button on the Easy Use widget up above. Go Flyers.